Okay, here we have a quick showcase for most of Dawson's buffs that came in today's Terry update. I'll be showing what they look like in practice and oh my god, look at that damage. Yeah, we'll get to that in a minute. Okay, to start off, now we have more frame advantage after grounded level 1. Allowing for an auto-timed drive rush slide. And of course, we're still in grab range. And it still works on back rise, so you don't have to worry about which rise they choose. And you're still in grab range. This next one's really cool. Level 1 on block does gray damage now. So the next hit after that adds about 8% damage. They also made it more safe and added pushback, making it harder for them to punish. Here's a little sequence putting you at that perfect spacing to stay safe. And the gray health you can rack up can get real nutty. If you get them to block 3 of your supers it gets really crazy. I really want to land this in a real match. OD Flame is now more consistent at farther ranges. So now you get more opportunities that didn't work before. They added more hits them to stand heavy kick, allowing you to link back a medium kick in this combo, making it do way more damage. Stand medium punch also has more hit stun. This kind of allows you to lock down your opponent better on hit. So instead of your limbs sometimes trading in zoning battles, you'll actually be stuffing them more often. Punish counter heavy kick into teleport is plus 3, so now you get a throw mix. This OD fireball used to stuff the driver slide, but now it doesn't. And look at this, you can kinda just spam medium punch now. This would absolutely have traded before. Okay, Nirvana Punch has less pushback on an air juggle, allowing for this new BNB. And coincidentally, you get a safe jump now. Okay, well that's all the practical uses I've found so far. If I find anything else, I'll post on Twitter. That's all for today. Bye.